southwest of Phnom Penh, Cambodia, where the Mekong River flows, there are vast vegetable fields. During the rainy season, lettuce leaves come under attack from a variety of diseases and pests, and as a result, lettuce is difficult to grow in squalls and heat. For this reason, pesticides are sprayed over the vegetables almost every day. I have to spray pesticides every day. I try to protect myself from the hazardous chemicals by wearing gloves and putting on a mask and a pair of long boots. Still, after spraying, I become very tired and thirsty. I drink tea with sugar and lemon to quench my thirst. If we don't use pesticides, we won't make money. Vegetables won't sell if they don't look nice. Besides, pesticides are commonly used, so I have to put up with it. The popular pesticide used by the farmer is uh, folidol. Folidol, uh, this uh, methylparation pesticide, the class one. Uh, this, is, this pesticide, actually, they are also banned according to the government regulation. The dangerous pesticide used here it also has to do a lot to do with the misunderstanding, with lack of information, lack of education among the people. Yeah. And uh, in the place where they still use pesticide, it's a problem because uh, the crab and the snail and so on people uh, eat. So then, uh, if it, if it, uh, the water is polluted with pesticide, of course they, uh, <laughs> it contaminated yeah, in the food chain. Yeah. In many other countries, large quantities of pesticide are used to produce vegetables in order to make them look good and sell for higher prices. These pesticides include those which are highly toxic. They cause damage to farmers' health and lead to contamination of the environment. Japan has also suffered damage from the misuse of agricultural chemicals. In the past, Japan spread such a large amount of pesticides into the environment that a sarcastic remark was made internationally about a big human experiment using pesticides. This film aims to show the damage suffered by Japan and the steps it has taken to spur recovery. Immediately after World War II, pesticides were introduced to Japan. A pesticide called DDT was dusted over the heads of the Japanese people to combat lice. During the post-war period, food shortages were the biggest problem. In an effort to raise yields, modernization of agriculture was aggressively pursued. Agricultural chemicals effective against disease and insect damage were rapidly introduced. Chemicals such as organochlorine, DDT, and BHC, organophosphate, parathion, and organomercury were spread in the fields throughout Japan. Weeding was the toughest of all agricultural work. This type of work has changed drastically since the introduction of herbicides. This is newsreel footage from 1950. ニオンディという薬が日本でも使われるようになりました。水に溶かしたニオンディを噴霧器でかけ、特別の装置で撮影した1週間の経過を見てみましょう。1週間目には Japan forged ahead with this method of increasing food production and with the modernization of agriculture. A pest control calendar was delivered to each village. Agricultural advisors instructed farmers to spray pesticides to kill every single pest they saw. In this way, a preventative system of pest control was created. This is footage recording cultivation inside a greenhouse. これに備えて技術員が床づくりや施肥の講習をします。いよいよ定食。苗を1本ずつ抜いて消毒します。
設園芸で企業的農業をというのがこの人たちの目標ですハウスの中には若さと希望が溢れていますはい。Meanwhile, these wonder drugs had faults. The use of the organophosphate pesticide called Parathion, otherwise known as Holidor, resulted in a spate of pesticide poisonings that left a large number of people dead. Within one year, its usage accounted for over 70 fatalities and more than 1,500 reported illnesses. Shortly after pesticides were adopted, the doctors of Saku Central Hospital paid particular attention to the unusual changes in farmers' health. Dr. Matsushima, who has seen many patients suffering from pesticide poisoning, gives testimony. First of all, you have to dilute Holidor with water. And then afterwards, you pour the concentrated solution into a tub. Some farmers mixed it with water by hand. They gradually became very sick, and eventually one of them died. Very rare footage showing patients suffering from pesticide poisoning still exists. Many patients are feverish, suffer from headaches and feelings of dizziness and nausea. When the symptoms worsen, they experience abdominal pain and diarrhea. And when they worsen further, They suffer cramps and may even lose consciousness. Many pesticides cause skin irritation and blisters. If you are exposed to pesticides through frequent spraying, it is likely that you will suffer from chronic toxic poisoning and will experience abnormal changes in your immune system and nervous system. <laughs> 